Today I will show you how to create the zoom through the eye transition. For more tutorials make sure to subscribe and without wasting any time let's get right into it. For the effect to look better first we need a close up video of the face. Place that on the timeline, extend the timeline so we see it better and then look for a frame that you like. So right here she looks straight to the camera. So we will take a snapshot of this frame and cut the video. After that you can remove the other part. So this is what we will work with. Because it's not possible to mask it on Filmora, I will show you another way. Right click on it and go to properties. You will find the location of the snapshot and go there. Or you can just search for it. Snapshot. This was the one. Go to open file location. And here it is. Open your browser and search for Pixlr. You will see this and go to Advanced Pixlr E. Next, open the snapshot and drop it. What we want is to make this eye transparent. So zoom in on the photo and we will use the mask tool. So click on it Change the tool to draw, you can see how it looks. If you need to change the size go to brush and increase it. You can also increase the softness to make the cut smoother. So this is enough. I want to remove only this spot, so click on it and you are already done. Then go to file, save and save it as a PNG file. So let's name it Snapshot 2. This website is free so you don't have to worry about anything. Then save that file with the snapshot. Now it's time to go back in Filmora. So here we have the new photo. Import it in Filmora. And place it on the second layer. Right where we cut the main clip. As you can see the size is darker because we removed it. This is the video that we want to transition to. So place that under the snapshot. Then right click on the snapshot, go to duration and change it to 0.20 and press ok. If you notice you can see through it. So right click on the snapshot again, go to crop and zoom, then to pan and zoom, click on the inner part of the video and make it as small as possible. Make sure to place it in the eye. So this is how it will look. After that is done press ok. If you notice you can see the other clip on the side, so we can increase the size of the snapshot, it doesn't matter. Now it doesn't cut. I want the eye to be darker, so cut where the snapshot ends, click on the first part of the second clip, go to color, scroll down to brightness and lower it. As you can see now it gets dark, press ok and go to transition basic and add the dissolve transition. So now it goes from dark to light. We can make this look a little better, so go to effects, down to utility and add this one on top of the snapshot. So let's make it the same size and now we have a little blur. Also if you want you can go to overlays and add black borders to it. So this is the final result. For more tips and tricks make sure to watch this other video.